Eric Keller here, Enthusiast Auto Group. Today we're at EAG's HQ with nothing short of the world's finest European spec, M635 E24, to survive in North America today. This car had just 5,000 miles and it was still on its MCO when EAG acquired the car three years ago. MCO stands for Manufacturer Certificate of Origin. And uh, well, uh, it was basically a brand new car. The car has spent the decade prior to our initial acquisition in none other than the Zentrum Museum in South Carolina at the BMW factory where the car was on display with a lot of other very significant and special pieces of BMW's motorsport history, the production history. And this car is the coolest E24 in all of our playbook, no question. We have the original wheels and tires. We have, uh, well, they still have the West German air in them if we are to be uh, uh, politically correct. <laughs> and this car is absolutely the nicest example we've acquired to date. I'm looking forward to sharing this car with you, going through all of its unique, uh, well, attributes and, and history and introducing you hopefully uh, to maybe your next car or at least one that you can aspire to given that this is well the top of the food chain. We, we use this car as our measuring device for all other E24s that come through our program and uh, I'm about to show you why. say on the highway this thing just rolls out it is a super smooth car the gearbox is new uh, everything on the car is new uh, the air conditioning is blowing ice cold there's not a lot more I could want. We gave it the inspection, we gave it the service, we gave it the love that it needed. Now you can give it the beans. <laughs> I want you to listen how quiet and solid and frankly how smooth this car is. We've got a slight hill, we're going to run one, two, three, listen. And another episode of why great brakes are important when there's a deer in the middle of the road. <sighs> that was kind of close. Oh, okay. All right. Back with you. Oh, oh, oh my. That was uh, a little too close for comfort. This car drives like it's brand new. Literally 5,833 miles. Like all good car acquisition stories, it all begins with a phone call, and in this case, uh, somebody that I've never spoken with before. He is quite an interesting individual that uh, has access to what he says is 
some pretty significant cars and he, he's working with uh, quite a seasoned and, and well uh, exposed collector that is in the E9 community, the, the 3.0 CS and CSL. And this Alabama collector had not only this M635 CSI, but uh, another CSI of 8 series origin, a red one, which really was the main car that we were uh, hoping to focus on at the time. And well, this bronze it well, obviously stole the, the light of, of the uh, conversation uh, quite quickly. And the car was never titled. It was in Georgia. It was imported through Hardy and Beck, which is quite a well-known organization in period, bringing in a lot of the 2002s and E9s. And, well, uh, it was a very interestingly optioned car given that it's the bronze at beige metallic over what is called the buffalo nutria interior we have the original floor mats in the trunk with the cocoa mats there uh, doing the, the duty and the car had a ads audio system installed in period which was quite an expensive system that uh, you'll find on our alpina b7 turbo and a lot of other cars in this period that was a premium option available that uh, a lot of the dealers would either upsell or Hardy and Beck in this case would upsell and I have to tell you that the smell of this car the leather the, the texture I mean feeling this it's I mean it, it's it's just I mean you can just totally pinch any uh, angle of it and it's 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 new the, the smell is amazing and it is absolutely the most honest and pure survivor condition car. Wait till you see the undercarriage photos that we're gonna uh, splice in here because it's just laden with cosmoline. It has an amazing, amazing uh, preservation level that frankly is super important for us to see as a, as a technical shop because uh, they don't make them like this anymore and finding them in this kind of condition is remarkably helpful in our process and, and then when we go through your car that might have you know 20 or 40 or 80 or 180,000 miles I mean listen to this it, it, it gives us a really great point of reference of exactly how everything should be and this car is nothing short of, of world-class number one condition uh, this is exactly what you will see right next to the webster D dictionary definition of said term or i should say the haggerty uh, definition of said term number one condition means basically the the best of the best the, the a world-class example uh, something that will win any event that it's entered into uh, for the most part uh, there's a better definition i'm sure on haggerty's website but that's my uh, <laughs> paraphrased um, impromptu uh, interpretation of it. The condition was original to all the factory recalls that had never taken place. Uh, there was a double valve spring setup that was uh, incorporated on the later cars that the early M6s did not benefit from and, and all of the US owners uh, had an option through the M registrar uh, and I'm, I'm, I might be uh, needing, a, a, again, a, an update as to exactly the specifics, but I believe it was noted through the M registrar that that was an option to you know, basically benefit from one time as an owner of these cars, and the parts would be provided to you. The labor at the local dealership would be your expense. And a lot of these M635s that we've owned uh, have had that done. Well, this one had not yet had that, uh, I guess, factory recall performed. And so we bought the parts and we installed that as part of the EAG rejuvenation program when we sold the car to a multiple repeat client, a dear friend, our first, frankly, biggest uh, client. Um, if you wanted to define him as a whale client up front early, that would be a very good description given that he bought some really great cars from us early on in our career and, and invested into the relationship in EAG. And, and uh, today he owns some of the best BMWs in, well, frankly, the world. And uh, that $17,500 investment into the car is what we did on his behalf to make sure that the car needed as little to nothing as humanly possible when the car had 5,338 miles. 
That was about two years ago or so, and uh, here today at uh, 5,800 miles and change, the car is ready to rock out with that ADS audio system with the most recent owner provided collection of the greatest hits of the era. This guy's got great tasty music. You think so? Yeah. He's got to be about my age. You pretty impressed? He's got good taste. <laughs> Little feet, that's good taste. <laughs> This is no shortage of the best of the best, and notice there is not a single cassette missing from this collection. It is the ultimate <laughs> greatest set of jams that the most recent owner could basically add his own a flavor in chapter two down to the uh, bubble wrap on the top. This is a vintage group of, of cassettes that will certainly sound amazing in this beautiful M635 CSI. It is complete down to every bit and bob in the toolkit and uh, every sticker. It's just, it's, it's, it's a new car. And I am super, super excited to introduce this car to the market and, and cannot wait to see the next owner, uh, hopefully in person, because this is a car that does need delivered in person. And if not directly in person, certainly they are going to earn their trip to the EAG uh, experience tour and come through the workshop and meet everybody because, I mean, this car, I mean, just listen to that door shut. I mean, it's just, this is a brand new example. I'm super happy, super proud of this car. Uh, the original wheels and tires do come with it, as I noted earlier, and of course the a brand new exhaust system is going to be included with it as well uh, if we do want to keep the car 100% stock and original. And those are the only two things that keep this car from stock original as the car was delivered to the first owner new. It's, it's just a beautiful, beautiful baby. <laughs> I'm very, very, very happy with this car, and I certainly hope the next owner uh, can appreciate it and, and share it with others and, and get, it, get the car out there and drive and that's exactly what I'm going to go do right now. So if you are interested in this car, please do drop us a line, reach out and uh, let's have that conversation. Call for price means let's uh, have that conversation and, and make sure that this is exactly what you're looking for because we do have other M6s available, several of which uh, are, have been repeat visitors including another blue M6 not yet shown on the website or the uh, the channel and that car certainly would be a, a good driver alternative to this brand new bronze thanks for tuning in subscribe for more see you